This video shows that the GI-275 powers the magnetometer from its own battery rather than requiring that rather than magnetometer requiring external power supply. As you can see the master switch is off. You can turn the uh, any of the two GI-275 by just pressing the small button once and the top one is a primary ADI, PFD primary ADI. When it first comes up, it says that it's aligning itself and so on. This little message on the screen will go away and you'll see that the heading is now red X until it aligns itself. Then it will come alive with the heading, uh, current heading. And that's because the GI-275, the primary ADI, has the magnetometer attached to it and it powers the magnetometer from its own internal battery. The master switch is still off. And it, nothing else is on, just the GI-275. And you can see now, heading bug is up and the heading is up. So, um, you don't need external power to, ma to power the magnetometer. It will be powered directly from the GI-275 and either through the master switch and then through the GI-275 to the magnetometer or from its own internal battery. Let me shut this off now and turn on the MFD standby ADI. And that does that. And I'm going to turn on the MFD standby ADI with its little button. Comes on, boots up. I need to get rid of this first message. And there we go. And it's aligning itself. Heading has failed as a top unit. Let's see what happens. As I said, the magnetometer is attached to the top unit, the primary ADI. Will we see heading now or not? Some of you already know the answer. This is different than the G5. And we still have heading fail. The reason for that is that the magnetometer is only connected to the primary ADI and that information then is transmitted to the MFD standby ADI via high-speed data bus. And since the top unit is off, the high-speed data bus connection is not active and therefore the uh, standby ADI does not see heading. In this case, um, it would uh, rely on its own internal VFR GPS to give it track as a uh, replacement for heading. And that's it.